Hi everybody, Ian here at Abelson at Tech in Burbank. Today we're gonna take a look at the version three firmware update for the Alexa camera. Uh, one of those updates is the ability to now record audio into the camera. The input for the audio is right here and it's a five pin uh, XLR male input. So what we've done is we've made a cable that is XLR3 female. The two are looped together. We put them in on our right and left channel. I'm gonna use a Sound Device 302 field mixer uh, to send a reference tone into the camera. But before we do that, we wanna make sure that our project frame rate and our sensor frame rate match each other. Once we know that that's been taken care of, I'm going to send a tone out on my mixer go into my audio window here, turn my controls and match it up to the reference tone that I'm getting on the mixer. And now we're ready to record audio onto the camera. The signal coming out of my 302 is an analog line level. When it gets to the Alexa, it is converted to digital 48 hertz, 24 bit audio. In addition to having the ability to put audio into the camera, we can also input timecode through the LIMO 5 connector located right here. With timecode, we can jam it in front of an external source, then Alexa will run it. In that scenario, you've got a uh, drift about one part per million, which means over eight hours, about one frame. We can also hook up an external source. This is an ambient clock it or you could use a device such as the ambient master clock here. Now, with a master clock like this, you can sync several devices at the same time, and you can check drift on all those individual items. So audio input and time code functionality, two great additions to a fantastic camera. Thanks for tuning in. See you next time.